I'm ready when you are. Big up you wearing the Primo for the Remo. I forgot I was wearing it. Mm. Shout out to Sharky. I ain't even got that pack kit. Shout out to Mandem. Yeah, but you haven't got to his office, but uh, anyway. <gasps> yeah, I haven't, you know. Yeah, and what's the name of uh, Sharky's partner? See, and you think you want to get Primo? Oh, Vassal. Vassal? Vassal. It's AV. AV. <laughs> and you want to get, you want to get, get a Primo. And I, I pay for my shit. No, Vassal, I said that on purpose, but I genuinely forgot AV. I've only met him once. We connected though, we hit it off, yeah, innit? I remember, I remember. You That's my guy. Shit. Yeah, Bridget. Good guy, good guy. But I uh, see you in the Louis Vuitton. Yeah. Very clean. Nice, innit? You look lovely. Thank you, bro. So do you. Thank you. What are you doing after this? Ask me on a date or? Nah. Well, actually, you can come if you want to come. I'm going to go nah, eat. I don't, I don't like if you can come if you want to come. That's not an invite. Guys, yeah. is that an invite to you? You can come if you want to come. Even if you... It, Say, I'd love you Even you can to... come is crazy. Yeah, you can come. Me- that's crazy <laughs> as well. You know what? I am not attending. How about that now? I will not be going anywhere to Philly because I don't want to come. <laughs> yeah. With that being said, it's your boy, Young Philly. Yes, my people. It's Big Chunks and we're back on the Chunks and Philly show. Yay! Now, um... We're going to get straight into it, man, Philly. Mm-hmm. Grey. Yes, it's out now. So, um, what made you want to drop this tune? Um, and when could you sing like that? Um, well, you know, when we used to do music, I, I, I wouldn't say, I, I wouldn't call it singing. I think like I can hold a note. I can't do what you do. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, but yeah, I've always been able to hold a note. Um, but certain songs I can do it on and certain songs I can't. Do you get yeah, what I'm saying yeah, to you? Yeah, you yeah. know, bro, you yeah. know, obviously I know you're yeah. asking me for the sake yeah, of like of camera, telling the, the audience, but yeah, there's like certain notes I can hit and there's certain notes I can't hit. And I feel like Grey is... What was the note that was the most difficult to hit in that song? Way You see, you can do so it live, bro. It's not just autos. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, trying to yeah. I'm just no, making that, sure that they that, know. That one was hard. No, but I need the auto tune and a little reverb. Just a bit, just to touch him. Yeah, just a touch. Yeah. <laughs> like, I don't need loads on her, but I need like, like something Kona. on her. Like Kona. Yeah. Oh, yeah, see, I'll yeah, never forget yeah. that does the stupid <laughs> thing. But yeah, man, um, the song's doing well. I'd appreciate it if everyone could support it. Yes. Um, Link's in the description. Yeah. I, Buy I, it. Yes, please. Stream, stream it. Stream it. Do all of them good things because I need to see Philly headlining Glastow in the next three years. Yeah, that would be amazing. <laughs> well, uh, well, yeah, I've done Park Life. Well, it wasn't a headline, but... No, but regardless, Park Life doing Park Life and someone proposed on stage and shit. Yeah, right? yeah. That's ridiculous. But yeah, it would be amazing, man. I'd love this I'd love this to be the highest charting song that I've, I, I have. And um, yeah, it would be absolutely mental and sick. Um, and also... And Rem- also, no, I wasn't involved in that song in the slightest. Yes! Let's he tell was. people. People keep saying, "Oh, we're here, chunks." No, I don't. I'm not in the studio anymore. Yeah. Uh, releasing music, so that was all Philly. Philly yeah. did all of that. Just certain ad libs have like effects on it, or like I'll make them deeper, or make them sound like in a phone texture thing. But yeah, no, that wasn't that wasn't chunks still. And remix. Yeah. Well, I don't want to say who's on it. Yeah. Keep it more of a surprise. Yeah. But it's but very yeah. exciting. Yeah. I'd like to have an international remix as well. Because at the moment, it's just UK-based. Yeah, and uh, let us know in the comments who you'd want to see on the remix of Grey, Young Philly. Um, but we're going to move on swiftly to... Did you see the Fellas podcast and what they said about the Chunks of Philly show? Yes. Can I ask you, though? Yeah. What was your take and how did you feel watching what they said? I was actually taken back by it. I was actually very happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I thought eight point five out of ten for someone that's solid. only done fourteen, fifteen videos. Uh, that's a solid rating, to be fair. Mm. And obviously, Cal Freezy, one of the OGs on YouTube. I've been watching him from 2012, 2013 maybe. Mm. So yeah, it was humbling. And obviously, Chip as well. Love and Chip, lovely guy, man. They were, they, both they, of them. They both have been showing my love from time. They were in my video from when I was on fifty k subscribers. I don't know if you saw that one. I don't think Chip was in it, but I think maybe he was. But I was. I did a fifty k subscriber special, and I asked Chip and. Like I wrote to Shaw, Anison Gibb, JMX, Car Freezy to be in the video. And I went down to their house and, and, and filmed and they let me, man. So yeah, I'll forever have love for the man them still. So wow. for them now to talk about the podcast and saying they loved it and they give it 8.5 out of 10. I'm happy, man. Yeah, bro. That's sick. Just going to work towards getting it to that 9 and 9.5. But as long as people are enjoying it, that's all that matters. Yeah. But in all fairness, they did say the only reason we're not a 10, because the, at the, I don't know if you watched that whole clip, but at the end of it, they've gone, they will be a 10. They can be a 10. Ooh. They based it on um, that the fact that we've just started and it's like longevity and we yeah. need to be consistent for a long period of time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? So, um, well, then you can give Jude Bellingham a 10 out of 10, can't you? Right now? Yes. You can so, bury yourself Jude Bellingham. 
new 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 kids on the block. Yeah. Yeah. Dropping good performances week on week. And they give him Judah 10, but they're giving us 8.5. Now I'm starting to think. Freezy. Wow. What are you on? Because he's not, he's not, there's no longevity in there. What's happening, Chippy? Wow. I'm at, now I'm starting looking at you guys differently. Because look, you can see right there, the shits and gigs. Uh, what did they give us, Lawrence? Yeah? We got guests. Don't do that one. I'm year. away from the mic. So um, next time, when you're, when, you're, when you're thinking about rating the man, then think about the accolades. Yeah? Yeah? 100k in like year. five minutes. Subscribers. Uh, okay, well, uh, no, maybe two days. Maybe, yeah, a couple yeah. days. But we, we did well. Yeah. So maybe you give us a nine next time. Yeah. Best guest of the year. You won the, the award. That was audience vote as well. Mm. So just yeah. saying. That's actually amazing though. Proper, proper humbling feeling. What would you give shits oh, and gigs out of 10? Genuinely? Yeah. Genuinely from yeah. the bottom of my yeah, heart. Yeah, yeah, genuinely. I'd I'll give them a nine, you know. Yeah. Mm. yeah. A bit higher. Yeah, I'd give them a 9.3. Mm. I'll give them a nine. Yeah, did you watch that one with Harry Panera the other day? I ain't seen it yet. Yeah. Is it good? Yeah, it was good, good, good. Is it? Yeah, it was very good. Very, very good. The darkest one is the best. Borderline, I think that's better than our episode. And that's the thing about losing it sometimes, man. <laughs> uh, because the guest of the year proves that it was actually us. Anyway, we're going to move on from that again. Mm -hmm. And quickly mention, I don't know if you've seen, but we did an Idris Elba podcast, what, two weeks ago, three weeks ago? I don't know how long it's been now. But... Have you heard about the fact that there's a ban on zombie style knives fast track by ministers after the campaign of Idris? Um, and the changes will close the loophole in the Offensive Weapons Act 2019, two weeks after he um, actually launched his new campaign. So, oh my God, Idris has done it. Yep, yeah, he's done it. And I'm so happy that we were allowed to be that vessel that kind of obviously let pushed people watch it, you know, pushed it out a little bit more. So, Billy, I just want to say congratulations for helping this act. No, no, is it confirmed though? Is it <laughs> no, confirmed? No, no, they, they generally are trying to fast track it. So they're gonna, gonna make it okay, happen. Okay, it's not done then. No, but, okay. The fact that it's <clears throat> catching traction, yes. the fact that they're doing this, is, for me, it means a lot, there's positives, but I feel like, because we've been, we're being heard, of course, that's even a better thing. So I just want a round of applause for Idris Elba. Very good, very good. <clears throat> You guys helped in that, genuinely. And yeah, we helped. You that. reckon, yeah? Oh, yeah, the, oh, the Tories man. absolutely love your podcast, for sure. Oh, like, there's, it's going around Whitehall. They're loving it. I wouldn't say the Tories. Yeah. <laughs> but um, no, nah, honestly, it's it crazy, man. I'm so you, happy for that. Do you know what I think is really Do you reckon you actually had an impact on that, though? I think, yeah. We were Why? What, what makes you think that we... Because of the fact that we were... We make noise. We make we made noise about it. You know what I'm trying to say. You know when things are kind of just pushed to the side and it's like ignored. No one, no one really cares because it's like it's not on the tip of our tongues. Not on. No one's really listening to it. Whereas because we were, I'm not saying we were the reason. I'm just saying that we helped because obviously we spoke about it and millions of people heard it and a lot of feedback was given back. Has, and, did it get good amount of views, bro? Yeah, man. Yeah, it did very well, bro. Like for us to be talking about knife crime for like a whole podcast and it got over a million views. Like pr pretty much long you know, watch I mean, time as well. Like long watch time really as well. So people time. were really engaged, and I really am happy that they were that engaged. Because obviously, when you think that's British Elba, I think a lot of people thought it was going to be banter, maybe us talking rubbish and having fun, which is cool as well. But we actually had a, 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 a interview of substance and and tried to get a good message across. So, and I watched it back, and I was really happy with what we done, man. I was proud of myself. I was proud of you. I was proud of everyone. So, mm. and uh, yeah, I'm just happy to be involved in that, man. So yeah, big up, like up said, yeah, big shout up Idris, to, man. Shout out to Idris Elba. Uh, do you know what I love about Idris is whatever he puts his mind to, it feels like he can do it. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you think yeah. you're, you're the same? Do you think like, whatever yeah. you put your mind to, Philly, you could do? No. Okay, that's fine. That's fair. No, I don't. And why is that then? I feel like sometimes God has like plans things written for you and plans for you. And I also feel like, because do you want me to be literal with the question? Yeah, of course. Some things are just not attainable. What we talking example. about? Yeah. It's a dumb one, but again, you said you want me to be literal, yeah? Yeah. A 70 year old man, it doesn't matter how hard he trains for the next five years, how much money he invests in technology to make him mad agile, he's never starting at Barcelona. Okay, I'm saying you, but I'm not 70 year old. Me? Yeah. I'm saying, do you think you can do what you want to do? No. Okay. I genuinely just think that God has plans for you. I feel like when I wanted to be a footballer, I tried everything in my power that I wanted to do. I worked, gen you know, like sometimes you get asked that question, yeah? Um, do you believe you tried your absolute best? I can confidently say that I tried my absolute best to make it as a pro and it didn't happen for me, bro. What was the reason you think? Um, just, I wasn't, I wasn't destined to be down that lane. I don't know, maybe. You think you're good enough? Yeah. For certain levels, I think I was, 100%. I played 
in and out of good standards. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. What's the yeah. highest level you made in the UK? I didn't sign for Charlton, but I was there for like, I was on the trial for like two weeks. Then it got extended for another two weeks. Um, and then it got extended for longer. So I was there in total for like just over six weeks. Mm. Um, and yeah, I played with some good players. Oh, I wonder if anyone that I played with made it pro. What's what's the guy that managed Brighton at one point? But P P O P E, the older do, guy. Yeah, from Uruguay. Um, I don't know. What's his name? Well, Diego well, Gas. What Gas Poyet? Yes, yes, Gas Poyet. I played with his son Diego. Is it? I'm sure Diego made it. I don't really know. Well, you played with him though, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, nuts. That was that. Yeah, bro, man, what's a baller? Yeah. So when you see me when you when you see me at Soccer Aid, yeah. and Sideman Charity Match. You get me? But he, um, yeah, he's I'll retired now. Huh? He's retired now. But yeah, he did kind of What, make Diego it. retired? Uh, yeah, it seems that way. Oh, he's my age. Uh, <laughs> maybe due to injury, innit? Seem, maybe. Seems like that. Where did he play at? Uh, Charlton. So, yeah, so pre he's not lying. I'm not yeah. lying. <laughs> West <laughs> Ham, Huddersfield, Milton Keynes, Charlton again. Oh, he made it pro then. And then he went uh, to... He made like, it, he made it. Yeah. Latvia. He went, I think he went to, uh, yeah, basically. And they went to Mendoza, which is- Chee yeah. Boy as well. Yeah. Oh my God, it was a guy called Chee Boy. His name was Jermaine, yeah? Serious player. So yeah, okay. So then that's, that's a fair example to be fair, obviously. Yeah. You it like is. You can't make it. So what do, you, what do you lot think then? Because that's my opinion. Obviously I'm basing it off my experiences. I genuinely think I tried everything in my power, brother, to to make it, but- Yeah, I think I, I do agree to some extent, sorry, because obviously like I'm saying now in, in your lane now, for example, if I say, do you think- like as a YouTuber, as an entertainer in your field, you can achieve anything. So for example, now, if I say to you, do you think if you wanted to, you could uh, star in a Hollywood movie? Like something that's attainable. You know what I'm trying to say? That's my opinion. Because I think it's stupid now me saying mm -hmm. as a as a chubby, mm -hmm. as a chubby boy now saying, I'm going to play for Arsenal. Like, I know I'm not, you know what I mean? I'm not fit. And you guys are kind of what you're what you're listing though are two different things. So yeah, I think I'm saying that's what I, I I'm being too I'm literal, saying, isn't it? I'm in saying in your lane, in in the person you are right now, young Philly, do you think if you tried everything with all your might, could become an an artist that has a number one in the UK or uh, you know what I mean, stuff like that? In terms of because I feel like we're very lazy with certain aspects of life. Yeah. Obviously, some we are on point. So I'm trying to say, for example, now if you put all your eggs in one basket and actually tried so hard. Do you think you could be in a movie? Do you think you could have a song with Ed Sheeran? You know what I'm trying to say? It's like things like that. Again, I'll still say no. Fair like, enough. Because only just wrong. because you gave the example of like music just there, yeah. Like, bro, I know certain artists that are so much better than me, you know? Yeah. Like, I'm talking unbelievable. Like, Benjamin AD is the first name that comes to my head. Like, he's a serious artist. And I might be wrong, but. Ben's not achieved what I've achieved musically, bro. Mm. Like in terms of like every time I drop a song, I've charted, fam. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? It might not be no top 10, but I've done top 40s, top 75s. And I'm holding it up there for a couple yeah, of weeks. Do you get yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? So I look at that and I'm like, well, he's better. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. And then sometimes you. music's a complicated one. You need money. Like I remember when me and Chunks dropped Hold Yeah, the day we dropped it, bro, we had the most sales in a, like the most sales or pre-saves, whatever it was in the world, bro. They sent us the list and be at, be at the bottom of us, it was Miley Cyrus, Justin Bieber. And then I think, what was the highest position? 19. In the charts? Yeah, I think yeah, it was 19. Well, we could, we could check official charts. 24, I think. No, but I'm talking, we peaked at 19. Oh. We didn't hold it there, but we peaked at 19. And then I remember seeing it the next day and then... I think our distribution told us at the time, yeah, someone must have pumped in hundreds of thousands of pounds because they was just below you and now they're, do you get what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, so yeah. what I learned with music is sometimes unless you ain't, was Rams barking uh, signed? Signed, yeah, yeah, signed, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah, I just feel like it's just money and label driven. So music's a bit of a techie one, man. Yeah. Do you want to know the actual highest UK chart position? Go on. It says here 29, am I wrong? So 29 would have been, on the Friday, which is at the end of the week. So that's what you're, you're charting. But in terms of throughout the week, um, we were getting told, oh, we are 19 right now. Try to keep, sustain that. So we try to keep oh, promoting, okay. promoting, promoting, and then it goes up and down. So I do remember mm. it was fluctuating. That must does that mess with your mind? Uh, not necessarily because of the fact that me and Philly aren't predominantly artists, obviously yeah. when I was making music at the time. Right. So it wasn't like no pressure. For me, it was like, I wanted to do it. I wanted to be in the top 40. That was mm. my aim. Yeah, yeah, we, that was what I We am. tried it with cleanup and I think we got like 70th or something. Yeah. So we were like, ah. Oh. And obviously when you get top 40, it's kind of like, that's like a mad achievement because 
you're listed and people can see that you're on the top 40, you know? So the fact that we wanted the top 40 and then we, we heard that we were like 19th in our heads, it was like a Wednesday and we're like, well, we're going to make top 40. Mm. So I still remember Friday it hitting and then we reached 29, like you said, I thought it was 24 and we were gassed. Yeah. Like, we're, we're a couple YouTubers, man. You know Literally, what I mean? Bro. At the time, especially because we're, no, we're nowhere near as big as we are now. So, you know what I mean? It was it was a mad, mad achievement for us. Like, yeah, sick in it. My come God. on, brother. Oh, you crazy. Oh, God. Let's go. Mm -hmm. You know when you're writing your songs, you write yeah. with other people. Like, great. Are you writing with other people? Yeah. yeah. I, yeah. I, I, yeah. I definitely, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to put my hands up straight away. I'm, I'm not good at penning. I'm not good at writing like lyrics. I'm very good at the melodic stuff, like singing. And uh, for example, someone could put on a beat and then they just come up with a melody. Yeah. And then it's actually putting pen to paper, which I struggle with. So it's like, I'm going to definitely need somebody. Eh, really... I wouldn't say you struggle though. Yeah. I, as in, I can write, but it's not like the final version. I can write a, a section and then someone will be like, that's good. But instead of that, like, do that. And you know what I mean? So yeah, it's so that's, 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 that's co-writing. Yeah. yeah. I feel like my best music has been co-written as well. I can't lie to you. Yeah, like, definitely man. But when there's, yeah. when there's people in a room and like, and it could be something, I think I write best year. So like, I don't know. I've had links write certain bars for me, bro. Like they could think oh, of a, yeah, oh, seriously, okay, okay. bro. Like I, they could think of a lyric and I'm like, oh, I get the concept. I don't like what you've did, but let me change this, this, yeah. this around and yeah. make it into this. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm, so but, essentially they, she co-writ certain bars with me. Do you get what I'm saying? Do they get that credit though? Yeah, of course. So no, what? What the link? Yeah, no. <laughs> that's, that's that's horrible. They should they should get their cut. I'm not giving a link the cut. <laughs> that's a mad move. You already, already giving them something else. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> he's giving them something at seven. But and yeah, half. no. I feel, like, I feel like the 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 best time I make music is when the studio's packed. When there's man that are rating right there, and yeah, it's just good vibes. You know what I mean? Even Michael Jackson had Quincy Jones and people like that. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Like Paul oh, no, bro, One thing I'm tell you right now: all the artists, not all the artists, but maybe 90, 95 percent have had someone write or co-write their tune. Like, I remember I heard like, you know, let me be in there, no, let me love you, Mario. You think Mario wrote that? He Neo wrote did. That. Yeah, to the left, to the left, everything you own in the box, Neo wrote that. You know how much, uh, Eric Belinga, uh, uh, Party Next Door, you know how much, work, 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 who wrote that? Party Next Door, bro. It's like, at the end of the day, people at the top of the game right now, like most of the time have people writing for them and that's absolutely fine. Uh, diamonds, shine bright to yeah, Vienna. I, who wrote that? See ya. You know what I mean, bro? Yeah. So it's like, be, I'll be honest, bro. That's absolutely the norm. Like a lot of people don't write their stuff, bro. Yeah, so. but for, as you see like for me, I feel like a, if I was to get to that, well, right now for me, it's so important to prove to myself, essentially, do you yeah. get what I'm saying? Yeah, like, but I'm saying there's no shame in having somebody that is, knows no, what, what doing. You see, after I drop this tape here, yeah, I'm in that bag. <laughs> Send me rhythms and let me just sing of, you get what I'm Rapper, saying? Yeah. No, I'm on yeah. all that. Yeah. Car, when certain men are dropping the album in the States, we're all going, oh, have you heard my man's new tune? What, so because it's little old Philly, the YouTuber, you're going to try to get at me. No, nah, allow me. I'm on all that, bro. Yeah. I Neo, hit me. He's coming to the UK in a couple of weeks. Is he? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's coming I in I seen him in the club once with his little sombrero hat. <laughs> yeah, I saw him in Qatar as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. He's guy. coming with Mario, actually. I think they're doing a joint concert. Yeah. In huh? London. Yeah. Isn't that wild? <laughs> that is sounding like vibes. I was trying to get, I was thinking like, maybe we try and book one of them for the podcast or but I don't know. We'll Neo and who? Mario. <laughs> oh my God. Let me be the one to give you everything. That would be amazing. You won't any. That would actually be amazing, you know. Oh, that would be incredible, man. All right, here's, here's a question for you boys, yeah? Do you think it's bad to expect from your friends? Yes. Why? Me and you have had this conversation before off camera as well. Yeah. I think you have too much faith in humanity, which is, again, a good thing, Philly. Unfortunately, maybe I'm a pessimist and you're just an optimist because, or optimistic, sorry, because of the fact that I feel like nobody owes you anything in this life and to expect the unexpected and to always try to work as hard as you can and not need any favors or anything from people. Even if you've done something for them, you're doing something for them out of this love of your heart and you're not doing it because of the fact that there's an ulterior motive that they're gonna help you in the future. And I'm not saying that you have ulterior motives. I'm just saying, obviously for you, with your kind heart, generally, I've, like I said, I've never met anybody so selfless as Philly and, and nice because he will do go above and beyond for a person that he loves and cares about. But in my opinion, because you've now done that for somebody, you can't expect them to give you that same love and and because they're not that person. They're not you. Mm. You get it? So everybody is different. Therefore, you have to embrace people's differences. 
just my opinion on it. Like if I now, for example, give you a hundred grand when you're down and out and say, for example, in five years time, I'm down and out and you give me 20, I'm not going to get angry at you. Yeah, and I feel like you would. No, 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 example, like no right genuinely, now, give, genuinely. Right now, I'll ask you for twenty bags. I said, yeah, mm. Philly can give me twenty bags. Mm. Let's say now, and God forbid, yes, time you don't have it like you like you do, and I've got even more money, right? And then you come to me and you say to me, "Can I get twenty grand or, or even more?" And I'll give you five. You'll be angry about that. Do you reckon? Yeah, you would. You would. What the f ba is that? Ba basing it on like something that happened recently, like I got a friend called Met, aka Slosh. Yeah, and I've helped my brother out so much. You get me yeah. to the point. He, he's more or less like a second PA for man. Yeah. That's bare things for me. Yeah. Like now he's my driver. Yeah, I saw him driving. I saw him waiting outside the car. And yeah, yeah. Great. He, like he does all my like Twitch set up. Yeah, I see. I see him do everything. But yeah, to the, the point where day, let me tell you quickly what he did as well. He was um, filming. Uh, he was helping Kenny do a live stream. And I said, yo, come on my team. I want you to be on my team full, full time. And he went, no, no, no. I prioritize Philly. Philly's number one. <laughs> wow. He did say that. I did say that. Yeah. Well, like, like, and yeah. He, he always says to me little stuff like, Randomly though, he'll be like, oh bro, I'm so grateful for you, you know, like the things you do for me, thank you. The other day he pulled up to my house with my two favorite things. Fanta and the Snickers, saw that. Yeah. But he got it in bulk, yeah. like a big tray of Fantas, a big thing of Snickers. And I know he can't repay me in the ways that I've helped him, but do you know how grateful I was for them Snickers and that Fanta, bro? I got emotional, bro. I gave him a hug. I said, my brother, thank you so much. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So based on that, that's why I got to disagree. But then I don't know. I, I suppose it's a different situation because I'm good now. Yeah. And I kind of do understand where you're coming from as well. Me yeah. being Brock and asking for a five when you got 100 mil. Yeah. But I don't think that's bad to expect that. I think it is. I think it is. I generally do. Do you because, reckon, brother? Yeah, yeah, I do. So wait, listen to what I'm saying though. Yeah. Go you're on. saying to me, you've got 100 M's and hypothetically. Yeah. You're saying to me, I've lent you 20 bags while I'm up, yeah? Yeah. I'm now Brock to piss. Yeah. You've got a hundred M's yes. and I've asked for 20 bags and you're giving me five and you're telling me I can't be angry. I, that's what I generally do agree. I'm saying, first, one thing I will say is, let me just say this quickly. Just Wait, am I going mad? Can I, can, I, can I say something? Can I say something? I'm going to quickly interject and say, if you are Brock and I had a hundred mil, I'll give you an M. Yeah, well, no, 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 no. This is I'm hypothetical. Being, cool. Yeah, I'm, this is I'm, hypothetical. I'm just being honest. I'm not, I'm not them little cheap youths yeah, that yeah, I, yeah. I'll definitely no, look no, after I'm, my peoples. But I'm saying, if now I'm in Philly's position and I've asked for somebody for, for money, and they've given me five bags, I'm not gonna be upset by that. I'm so grateful for the fact that you managed to still get me out of a hole. How are you now expecting somebody to give you more money when they're already doing you a favor? No, no, but I'm not saying I won't be grateful. But no, you're saying you'll be angry. In the back of my you're mind, you'll be angry. No, I would, but I wouldn't express that anger to you. But I'd, I'd be like, you little fuck face. I had you when you didn't, <laughs> when you didn't help me. Why Do you wouldn't get you what? express that then? Why wouldn't you tell him? <laughs> because it's like, I, it's now because I've always been this way. I can't lie to you. I've you always, have. I've I, seen yeah, this. Yeah, no, I've he, seen he it. Is that, your, is that your emotional? Think about this now. Like. Philly is so giving, like I said, and he's to the point. No, the I've stuff never I've seen done any, for people, Lawrence. Yeah, to the thing, you won't I, believe to me, the bro. Where, bro, I, I, I'm like, you've lost your mind. Like he'll yeah. tell me what he's been doing. People us laugh and say you're never. Yeah, gonna get and he'll paid. and he'll tell me not to do shit like yeah, that. Yeah, generally, like it's over the top, right? But then now, for example, if he does me a favor and it's incredible, and I'll try to repay him, and it's not as big, I can see he's annoyed about it, and I'm like, bro. I'm not like you. I'm not built like you. I'm not going to go crazy and, and do this so much. Like, I understand you did it for me, but you can't now expect me to give you the same love you did. I believe me. I can. Huh? I've just given you 20 bags. I've got five racks. And you're, and you're upset about that? Yeah. Fez. I, I think if you're now, if you are upset about it and you keep that within yourself and you don't project that onto me, I think that's fine. Okay. Because you can feel something. I know you can't control your emotions. If something happens and it's just the way you react to things, that's not a problem. That's cool. But keep that inside and don't try to project it and try to vocalize it and make me feel bad when I'm the one that giving so you So in this hypothetical situation, do you reckon the tone that I, in this case, would go back to you means everything? So imagine our two tones, yeah? Yeah. I could go, oh, brother, five, thank you, man. Appreciate that, but... Yeah. Remember I dropped you that little 20, you can't do another 15. Okay, look, me. that, I've got, should I tell you? No, 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 no. Let me tell you, let me tell you. And I'm gonna, okay, you can do the next approach after. I'm gonna yeah. show you what was wrong with that one. <laughs> yeah. Why are you mentioning the fact that you gave me the 20 last time? Because I'm brought to peace. I know, but then that shows there was ulterior motives when no, you were handing out the no. money. Because you, think, you gave the money expecting now, if something happens to me in the future, you've got me. You can't expect that. No, 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 no. If but now, if now, look, fair enough, bro. You give me the 20 bags mm. and you can, well, I mean, it's fair to say that I'm a shit person because you gave me 20 when, when, when I was down. I should at least give you the same respect and give you 20. Yes. But your, what I'm saying with you, the problem is you expect 
you like you think and you have a, you feel a type of way and then what you end up doing is mentioning the fact remember when I did this remember there's no people on this earth I hate more than the remember I yeah, did yeah, this same, that's same, fucking same, same, shit same. It's because in my head I'm thinking well if that's if, if, if all our if our friendship transactional where it's constantly remember I did this and you can do this and, then what 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 is this right now yeah. what really is this now okay do a second approach and let me see what I'll tell you about that one uh, my first one was the humble tone, like calm down one. So that was humble. Fuck. Yeah. Let me see the next one. I thought it was a little bit um, passive, passive aggressive. Yeah. Passive aggressive. It was very passive. Next one. It was. It was a little bit manipulative. Yeah, man said, man said. Uh, okay, so look, look, let me give you a different one. Yeah, no? on. So that was passive aggressive. Yeah. Let me give you humble, humble now. Yeah, hum give me a, give uh, me a humble. Brother. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, let me Hands get my bag. Let yeah. me get my bag. Yeah, get it, Brother. Man. Yeah. Thank you, man. Yeah. Um, This five is, is going to help me a lot, but... Oh man, an extra 15 will help me out for the rest of the year, man. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you okay. Can do I, I like it. I like this. I like this a bit more. But you know what I don't like? <laughs> Dad, I don't like? you know what I love about Chunks? When yeah. he's going to spill some serious beads. Yeah, no, yeah. Do you clock? He grabs that yeah. cuff and does this. Okay, You've been an amazing director, by the way. Yeah, yeah. No, I, 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 like I like the emotion. Good emotion. I love the emotion. <laughs> I love everything about it. The hand gesture. Love it. But what I don't like is why is it the same amount as what you borrowed me? It just ah. seems too, too No, out. but then- you I, ask for 50 is what you're saying. Just ask, well, lie, why not? Well, well lie. if I've got 100 million, then that's not a problem. Don't make it seem like I'm repaying you for what you did. Mm. But then do you, know, like do you know what we're right. both doing I'll wrong? I'll do for 25. Do you know what we're both mm. doing wrong in this? Remember, uh, this is all hypothetical, yeah. you know? Yeah. I need everyone to understand. No one, you go, no, Chunks, seat, he yeah. was wrong for that Philly. You was wrong. Yeah, this is just, yeah. It's just, just, we're making up scenarios, isn't it? But um, I feel like we're both just assuming. About? Without even asking each other. You're assuming that- I've got ulterior motives because I've asked for an, for an extra 15. That could have genuinely paid the rest of my rent. But in the back of your mind, you're remembering our- Yeah, okay, okay, now, now, okay. And let, you let, me tell you, let me tell you now the right approach. This is now. Okay, so I'm asking you for the time. <laughs> right? All right. Let's say like I'm behind on bills. No, 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 so, no, no, come on, okay, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Go on. <laughs> no, I'm serious, I'm in my bag, bro. Yeah, yeah, go on, so I'm on the phone. Yeah, no, yeah, no, 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 knock on the door, knock on the oh. door. Hold on, babes. <laughs> Yo. My brother, how are you saying, family? Bless? Yeah, man, bless can't come in. Yeah. What's this tone? Why, why are you giving me that? No, I just, this girl's stressing me out, bro. I uh, know, uh, but generally, like, I just want to say I really do appreciate that five. <laughs> what the fuck's sakes, man? <laughs> bro, let me, I'm, I'm, I'm in there. I'm in there. Wait, I'm serious. Three, two, one. Bro. Action. Well, I just want to say I really do appreciate the five bags you gave me, bro. I'll yeah. be honest. Um, but obviously, like everything's, I'm behind on bills. I'm behind on X amount, and yeah, no, no. Obviously, like you remember, I've done a lot of stuff uh, in in the, in the past and shit. Not not with us, of course not. I'm just saying in terms of like, I've got too much. Um, what's it called? Arrears? Is that how you say? Yeah, too know. much arrears, and I've got like I'm back backlogged on 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 bills and stuff. And look, I've pulled out. I've got evidence now. Obviously, as you can see, this is like uh, something I owe twelve thousand pounds, and this here's another five thousand. Obviously, I'm not trying to make you feel bad, yeah, yeah, and I yeah. really do appreciate the five. But obviously, if it would be possible to get like to just pay off these, and that comes up to like thirty three grand, um, and in the future I'll find some way to pay you back because I really do appreciate that, man. Yeah, and obviously, if you can't do it, then I really do appreciate the five that you've given me in the first place, brother, man. You've called me at a bad time, man. Right, what's up, bro? I've just put certain money away, ISAs, bonds, it's all kind of tied up at the minute. No problem, bro. Absolutely fine. Uh, is there anything you can help? Or oh, uh, you've wrote the fives? Five, five, five great. You're right. So that's how you would feel super comfy with that approach, yeah? Very comfortable. That's not, at the end of the day, I don't owe you anything. Yeah, but I'm saying to you now, hypothetically, obviously, I've got to keep on saying that because the internet. Yeah. Um, I'm asking for the extra 15, but that's the actual bills for the year. I just ain't showed you what you showed me. I, just want, I just want to see it. Do you know why? Because he makes it, makes it known that, oh, you know, I actually need it. Yes, I'll do that for you. No problem. Interesting. No, but in our case, again, I've I, I got to stop saying that, but yeah, you're not drawing me. Um, I'm your brother. I don't need to show you that. Same times when when I was broke and you did lend me money, I didn't show you nothing, blood. Mm. You just took my word for it that I needed yeah. it. And that's because I did. I'm not yeah. going to sit here now and start no, but I'm saying, why opening you, up letters and taking pictures no, for I'm bro saying, and guys. Do you know what it is? It makes it, it, makes it real. You know what I'm trying to I say? No, but it, no, no, no. But this one now, this uh, bit is actually real. Back then, I didn't show you nothing. But, you took but my you, word for it because but I'm, I'm you, your... You've just, you've just, you've added this. I didn't know that was the case back then in the days. I didn't know that in this hypothetical situation. I didn't know that. 20... No, no, no. I, I, I weren't like struck. Actually, I was, bro. I needed money for certain things because I didn't know how to save money at that time. Yeah, but I'm saying, you know, when you're asking, when somebody asks for money, yeah, they ask for a specific amount in order to get them out of a hole, correct? Yeah. 
Yeah. They wouldn't just, if they need three grand, why are they going to ask for seven? Well, yeah, sometimes people might plan ahead or they might yeah, think, well, yeah, I can yeah, pay, yeah, I can yeah, pay that yeah. seven off. And also it depends on how comfortable you feel with that person. Yeah. And you might think, well, you know, if this person's got a hundred mil. Just then- a caveat, by the way, I have no qualms with my family or friends asking for money. It's just, it's, it's, the, Good to it's know. the way you ask, you know? Yeah. Like it's that sense of expecting it because of the fact I've got money, which is the problem compared to now just being grateful and saying, this is the situation I'm in. What's the um, what's the furthest in your friendship group that you think is acceptable to ask? Kind of, yeah. Uh, what do you mean the furthest? So like, like, you know, obviously you've got immediate family. You've got immediate family, okay. Immediate family, covered. Best friends that I have, covered. like for example, Beta Squad, Harry Pinero's Phillies, Darkest, covered, covered. yeah? People that I grew up with in my area, um, case by case, of course. Funny as long enough. as they bring the bills. Huh? As long as they bring the bills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. As long as you that kind of just show me that you're not just trying to take me for a, a, a yeah. pussy, basically. And that's absolutely fine. Now, when we start getting into the problem areas, is podcast when it's producers, friends, friends, yeah. Podcast producers, yeah. you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like, this is, but it's funny you say that, but I generally, with that one, I think, yeah, I, and I do use this phrase a lot, but it is generally case, case by case. case yeah. What is like, your situation, bro? What do you is, get what yeah, I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Like, do you have is wife, your youth not kids? eating? Because if your youth's not eating, brother, take my yard for the week. Yeah. Then what, what I'll go about? live with my mum for a bit. Yeah, look, what? You, look, 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 you know what you said? It's take a lovely my house gesture. for a week. I'll live with my mum for a bit. He, it's like, there's other ways to, to help you. He's decided now to go to the extremities, which is amazing. And I said, the thing I love the most about Philly, why are you giving someone <laughs> house, your fucking house? You can just put them know. in a hotel for a week. I think it, that's you know, just I, what I'm like. I think it I is genuinely a bit can't help it, man. Mm. I genuinely like. Do you know? Even when I first started making money, yeah, like I couldn't, I couldn't fathom me being around my brethren and buying certain things and them not having it. So if I bought an LV bag, yeah, get him the grey one as well. I swear to God. And I realize I now, it's incredible. No, 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 but, 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 no, but, but, but it, guess what? Guess what? Your heart's going to get broken no, so no, fast. No, 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 but it, is, it is dumb. It was dumb. It's not dumb if you only do it once. That's great. That's great. That's but great. I was I get doing it, it a lot. every single time. I'm talking holidays. This guy, this guy's doing business holidays. He's bringing four people. They are on business holidays with him as well. Because so I've looking... only done that once and I'll never do it again. Chunks' response was that. He was like, why though? But I couldn't, I, you... I couldn't. How is it we're all going on holiday and I'm business class and you like our economy? Right. So, like, so I know you can't, let me just, I, I know what, you can't afford look, 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 look. This is what Philly's done, yeah? Philly's gone on holiday and he's in business class and he's brought all his friends to business class with him. So I tell you what I'll do? Bank the air miles. I'll pay, I'll pay for all their flights, but we're all going on economy. Nah. As in do you, you know were, where we went? No, we went to Australia. I might sit in 24 hours like that, itch up. Okay, I'm cool. not doing it. So I'm saying, For the okay, audio okay, listeners, cool. I just put my back mad straight right, and right, I'm going so to Tell me now, Lawrence, is there a problem with me now with four of my friends? I pay for my own business, but I pay for all of their premium economies. Is yeah, that yeah, yeah, no, no, you're right. No. You're right. You're, oh, I'm paying for my friends. You know, I'm not saying, no, but I'm that saying that's, I'm right for doing that. I'm just saying to you, I'm just saying to you, you've done that now, which is now meant now whenever you're need, you need help or whenever and you ask for that same energy back to your friends and they can't provide it, but you feel the type of way, that's your fault. But is that because no, proportional no, but, though? That's no, proportional. No, that's Another fine. friend might say to him, I bought you, so someone might earn very little and go, oh, I bought you lunch. And to them, that is the same as buying a business class yes, upgrade yes, yes, proportionally. Yes. proportionally it, them their, buying lunch their... for him is the same percentage of their income yeah. as him yeah, going yeah, no, as whatever it is. But I, I didn't mean it in that sense. Like I wouldn't expect that from my brethren. Do you get what I'm saying? Like a business class flat is different. But again, I'm going to go literal like I did with the 70 year old man. Yeah. Did you I enjoy like... it? What? The did, did it enhance your experience you of your life? Dibs. Yeah, just, <laughs> I'll, I'll beat that. No, did no you, joke. Did, but did you did it enhance your overall life experience that you were in business with all your friends? Yes. Th- yeah, in terms of ex- yeah, it was mad. Yeah, fine. I remember the man with no, drinking. No, but it's not worth, bro. <laughs> it's no. I understand that. Genuinely, I spent <laughs> grand before I even left. A Again, man, I'll beat a that. A man hasn't touched Australian waters and he's already <laughs> chips down. Yeah. <laughs> Stop that saying it. It's more beach. Stupidest <laughs> thing ever. <laughs> Okay, but don't get fun, no. can, can, Great so memories. The, what I'm left with in my mind is that what you two are basically saying is um, that maybe there should be one rule for everyone or kind of there's there's a rule that we all apply. What I feel like is there's a rule for your heart and there's a rule for your heart. You're not a worse person because you wouldn't give someone a business class. I know I'm not, brother. But also it's not a terrible thing if you're generous in different ways. No, mm. look, I don't have a problem with the, uh, how generous <laughs> Philly is. What you I, look clock, you I, always I, trust this. The thing I have a problem down. with is the fact that he now gets upset if they don't reciprocate. That's the problem I have. 
Yeah. I don't have a problem with him being generous. Cause that's, that's great. That's a great, that's a great. It's uh, a great thing for me, for all my friends around me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but it's a, it's a great trait to have. And I'm, what I'm saying is the question, what was the original question you asked brother? Do you uh, believe in expecting things yeah. from people? Well, your problem is because of the fact you're so generous, you do expect, and that's the problem. That's for me, you get it? Cause same way now, for example, I might not be them as generous as Philly, guaranteed. But if I ask something from somebody else and they don't, they don't manage to provide it for me, I have no qualms. But wait, 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 I do want to clarify this cause I don't want to be painted in a bad light. Bro, I'm, like, I'm painting in a bad light. No, no, I disagree. Screw I disagree. Jeffrey. I disagree. Huh? Screw I disagree. Jeffrey. I disagree. Yeah. But then some things are literal. Like I expect chunks to be at my wedding. Standard. I think that's a reasonable expectation to put on one yeah, of your yeah, best yeah. friends. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, bar, so bar again, the fact I, I have... always like the literal ones. So you can expect. Okay. Friends, I'm bro. saying it's I'm unreasonable saying, for the best well, man well, not well, to be there. What if there's a death? Okay. Wow. Plot to. If my auntie's died, my head's gone. I'm not thinking about nothing else. Yeah. I'm the man of the house. I have to provide it. I have to do certain things. My brother, congratulations with the wedding. I'm going to check in with you when you come back from the honeymoon. Yeah, plot right now, man's just going to a funeral. What, you got no, a problem? No, 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 plot twist. Plot twist. get angry. Plot twist. You know what I'm trying to say? Unless, unless, I, unless now you bell me. Can we shake hands though? This conversation here, yeah. top tiersy. Unless now you bell, like man. Like unless wow. you bell me now and say, yo, come to my wedding. And I say, ah. Damn, that's a problem. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm. Especially that's, if you're best man. Yeah, I get it. That's an issue. But yeah. well, man just had a fatality. I've got things to do, broski. Mm. But I, I hear it. And man's been supporting your wedding and I've got the gifts coming through you. That I just can't be there. But love, I'm going to send someone to be there in, 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 instead of me. You know what I mean? Like mm. man's brother or man's cousin to just kind of represent me. You wouldn't want him there though if he's if he's going to be mourning someone. I'm not saying, you know, you go, oh, I don't want you because you're yeah, that's a good point. You, know, you don't want to drag him to a wedding and go, oh, yeah, celebrate with him. Yeah, you're my friend place. as well. Yeah. The same yeah, way yeah, I'm your yeah, friend, yeah, you're my yeah, friend. Yeah. But that's yeah, not yeah, his yeah. expectation. So but you're, the minimum expectation is that you should be at his wedding if everything's good. Yeah, yeah. And I would. And I would. Yeah. I, well, can, no, can, no, no, no. Say that now down the camera. Just make sure. I want if to... Philly gets married on fucking Pluto, I'll be there. Like, yeah, I'll yeah. jump on the jet and I'll just get there. So it's not a problem. You, want, you mean rocket, rocket. Huh? Yeah. Get, yeah. get me in Apollo 11th, yeah, whatever, yeah. whatever. You know what I mean? But I'm just saying, obviously, strenuous situations and certain situations, I might not be there, bro. Yeah. If man's got flipping some crazy illness and I'm in the hospital, like, come on, bro. Look Tra after me, Yeah. Maybe death is the wrong one. Childbirth. Yeah, huh? Childbirth is not. I'm, I'm going to be at a childbirth. Understandable. Yeah. I'm going to be at a childbirth. Mm -hmm. If they said that they expect. I'll, I'll get married where his baby's giving birth then. Yeah, that's only if he's a real one. Nah, I'm joking. That's like, a real one. Obviously, if man's, got, man's got a wife and she's given birth, expected date January 24th, and his wedding's on the 24th, I've got to be in. Because he's probably going to do a destination holiday in Italy or something. I'm, I'm, bro, I'm too busy. Are you yeah, not? I want to get married in I knew. Lake you, Como? Lake, Lake Como. Como. Yeah. Northern Italy. Would you not uh, at least explore the idea of taking a doctor with you that if yeah. you're- No, you're no, mad. No, shut no, up, no, Lawrence. No, 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 no. Just no, fucking no, no, explore the checking. idea. It no, is, I'm not even. I'm not even let my wife be again. comfy in her bed, nah, then her room, yeah, then I'm push out. This has proper. been nine months. This is man's, this is man's baby. Like, I really- My are. everything. What are you asking him to go to Como? That's- Man's world. But best believe though, Zoom call, I'm preying it from the- Maternity ward. Question, yeah. if the wedding does happen to be on the same day as the due date, do you look into moving the wedding date? If, if it's, if, yeah, yeah, yep, yep. What, have you if thought I'm about that? If I'm Chunks now and his wife what, is pregnant. What, Chunks or it's just any friend? Chunks. Uh, or uh, Chunks in that level. Yeah, for Chunks, I'd move it. Yeah, Panero? Yes. Darkest? Yes. AJ? Nah, nah, I'm not as close with AJ though. Fair, really, fair. Really, really. I'm actually Just not as close with AJ. Yeah. But look, say for example now, I, I, we know, have our I, know that, I know that Philly's missus is pregnant right now. Mm. She's six months, she's four months pregnant. And I know that the date that me and my girl are talking about is in and around the Judah. I'm saying, babe, can we look uh, maybe a month after or two months after just because I know bro, she's going to have his kid. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. No problem. It's just easy. Mm, mm, mm. You know what I mean? Even if it's, if it's booked and there's certain things now, deposits paid for, it's a headache now. You get it? But... If, I'm on if, it's, stages, if it's possible to move, I feel like you're saying then man will move it. Yeah. Would. But if you can't, like you can't, innit? All right. So this section is famous death row meals. Oh, dun, dun, snaps. This so, is a classic, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Well, well, is it? No, it is a classic in terms of like a dating question. I feel like um, a lot of people ask that. Do you know what I'm <laughs> asking? So do you know what I'm saying? Is oh, as in what, if you were to die, what would be your last meal? Yeah. Yes, like yes, the, right. the other day I was filming with oh, was, uh, yeah. Jim Shark and they was, we was doing a dating show. And every guy that was on a date asked that girl the question. And I was like, wow, maybe this is something that, so, this is a question that for someone that has no riz that they ask people. <laughs> have you really thought about it by the way? Cause it's yeah, quite- I a, have, I have. Like, I don't mean, have you really thought about what your meal would be, but have you really thought about the idea of a death row meal? It's your last meal on planet earth. 
And after this meal, you are now no longer going to be on earth. It's, yeah. it's you're and potentially in your mind as a murderer then, or you're going to hell. This is your last <laughs> meal. Do you know what I mean? And not only that, this is the last thing that you ever taste. The last taste in your mouth. Yeah. You might have heartburn the night before if you have the wrong meal. Do you know what I mean? Boys, yeah. take this perspective. A part of me is thinking, fuck it, just get it done. So you don't in the end? Fuck it. I'm gone in a couple of hours. But I want some Do, do you see where I'm coming from though a little bit? No? Mm. Nah, not for my my, my Like I get that you can I enjoy it. Lo- I best believe I'm ordering the world. I need everything. I need everything before I go. But quickly, I'm gonna mention to you, brother, Ted Bundy. You know about Ted Bundy? Good centre back for Wigan. <laughs> you thought it was a centre back. What Ted Bundy? Yeah. What team do you play for? No, it's a serial killer, my brother. Oh, you're lying. You never knew about Ted Bundy. I only know um Jeffrey. Jeffrey Dahmer. No, man's saying these names like they're my brethren. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jeffrey. Yeah, be careful. <laughs> Jeff, yeah. but Ted Dance. Bundy is a horrific man, by the way. They, Worse than Jeff. I would, they're, they're both it, just disgusted. So Ted Bundy, Theodore Robert Bundy, born November 24th, 1946, was an American, American serial killer who kidnapped, R word, and murdered dozens of young women and girls during the 1970s and possibly earlier. After more than a decade of denials, he confessed to 30 murders committed in seven states between 74 and 78. So... This guy, you know, you don't know much about Ted Bundy. I never want to talk about his, his crimes because they were so heinous and so oh, man. disgusting that yeah, I just I just hate that man. And bear in mind, he had like a whole cult following that of, of women that actually loved him. They but just, just so I can understand, what, was he was these crimes on Jeffrey's level? Jeffrey's uh, level. Yeah, he, yeah. Mur- he murdered people. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, no, but no, 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 no. He ate them. Jeffrey done a madness, no, bro. No, Jeff, Jeffrey them. was yamming them. He was eating them. But what he what they're definitely of equivalent level, hundred yeah, yeah, yeah. percent. But what then happened was he's then getting tried for these crimes, and during the trials, there's women in the flipping courts in the courtroom, Adam! fans love them off, writing them letters. Was he a good looking brother? Um, I think for the time, if you look at him now, you yeah. very av. Yeah, 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 but yeah, back yeah, at the time, yeah, he's a shit box now. But by the way, he had obviously had a he wasn't put on death row, of course, like he should have been. Um, and he actually declined his final meal. Um, so they made him have the default option. Do you know what the default option is? Get, have a guess. Steak. Wow, steak. Yep, medium rare. Yeah. He had uh, hash browns, eggs over easy, toast with jam and butter, orange juice and milk. He boxed it all. I don't know if he boxed it. Apparently, um, there are people who say he didn't touch it. So he was given it, didn't touch it apparently. But yeah, there are if, if, he, if he's not requested nothing, then fucking hell, you don't want to eat, innit? I can't lie, do you know who, whose meal is my favourite probably, yeah? yeah? Thomas J. Grasso. Obviously, he strangled his neighbour to death. So with, was, with, he, with Christmas lights. Oh she was 87. And it, oh. Uh, yeah, probably deserved it then, innit? Died by lethal injection. I love crime documentaries. Shall I tell you what he ordered? Mm. A double cheeseburger, barbecue spar- spare ribs, half a pumpkin pie with strawberries mashed alongside with whipped cream, steamed clams and mussels, two strawberry milkshakes, a can of spaghettios. I think he did that murder so he'd get that meal. Because <laughs> why the hell... Yeah, did you order the whole? That's the world. By the way, the can of spaghettios was room temperature. Oh, hey, oh, he's, yeah, that's, he's a serial killer, isn't it? Boys, yeah. weird. Ain't you ever thought why do they give him a meal? Like, why do they get that luxury of doing that if you are a scum? Because you're still Ooh, human. Not bad. No, not bad no, deep it, bro. And you, how about this? How about this? I watch a lot of the crime. Why are you getting that luxury? Bro? Let me tell you this. Let me tell you this. Let me tell you this. Do you man in prison. Hold on. Yes. Sorry, but man in prison that I've done way less worse than what these sickos are doing. Don't get that luxury. So, so I'll tell you one thing about prisons, the judicial right, system in America, about yeah? How about this? The people that are on death row actually live better than people that are in supermaxes. Yeah. Like, because of the fact that they are, they have their own space, they have their own tools, they have a lot of things that they are. So a lot of people that do like a crazy crime and they know that they're never going to leave prison, they ask to be put on death row a lot of the times because of the fact that their quality of life is much better in a, being on um, death row than a supermax for your whole life. Because supermax is your... Under complete lockdown for 23, 24 hours, solitary confinement. You don't see people put, put through the thing. Like you go crazy most of the time. So they just get asked. You might as well just up my flipping ante and put me on a, on a, on a death row thing. When did you ride your bird 06? Me. I did 06 to 2018. <laughs> 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 that was good one. Uh, but, but yeah. His, his go on, give me another crazy. meal. Give me another meal. Stephen Woods executed in 2011. His crime was the murder of a young, a young couple even after many appeals and being backed by some popular non-profit media organisations. Last meal, two pounds of bacon. A large four meat pizza, four fried chicken breast, two drinks of each Mountain Dew, Pepsi, root beer and sweet tea, two pints of ice cream, five chicken fried steaks, uh, two hamburgers with bacon fries and a dozen garlic bread sticks with marinara on the side. I think when he died, he probably vomited that all out. Genuinely, man, I I, I don't agree with that, you know, giving them such luxury. 
It's yeah. a lot of food. Nah, well. bro. Like, and how can you order all of that? That's not fair. A man ordered, Marion Albert Pruitt ordered three, two litre Pepsis. What the fuck are you doing with that? He said, yo, let me just catch a quick diabetes before I leave. Quickly. Early, yeah, man. like what is he really on? Okay, but Philly, God forbid, if you were on death row, what would be your last meal? I'd get a guacamole. <laughs> What'd you call it? Guacamole or guacamole? Guacamole, yeah. With the little... Dips. The, the What's it called? Tortillas. The, yeah, the tortillas there on the side. That's the, that's the starters there. I'm going to have a uh, prawn mackie. You know, every time you order food, you know, it's that one. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm going to have the prawn, <laughs> ma pro, mm, prawn mackie rolls there. Yeah. Let me get the shrimp popcorn. Yeah. That's This is all starters. Yeah, yeah. I see these men go mad. And <laughs> Bro, they go wild. Keep order. going, keep going. Yeah. I also, is it possible, yeah. only possible to get... <laughs> The raw sea bass with the jalapeno. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, oh, you man, I got palate. Yeah, 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 yeah. With the with the jalapenos on top, uh. with the avocado sauce. Uh -huh. You know about that one, CC. We don't even say too much with that. <laughs> yeah. Um, let me get into the main area now. Fuck no, that was starters. <laughs> <laughs> That's a starter. Yeah. Who are you? Fuck. But they, they're ordering loads. Why can't I? No, you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, of course. No, Let can. me get chili and sea yeah. bass. Yeah. <laughs> chili sea bass, yeah. white rice, broccoli. Yeah, and A5, Kobe Wagyu. Wagyu. Wow. Let me get peppercorn sauce. All, All right. right, then. Mushroom sauce. All right. And let me get mashed potatoes. For the potatoes. Mm -hmm. What's it, what kind of mashed potatoes? Is there cheese in there? Is there butter in there? Is it nah, quite creamy or is it butter. quite... Yeah, just the young butt. Standard Ch mash. Mm, yeah. Creamy. Ah. Uh -huh. And then that'll fill me. Okay. And Let then me what? move on to the dessert. I love a crumble. Ah! Yeah. Let me get custard with Verka. I don't understand why people have- Ice cream. Uh, doesn't make sense, sense. to me. Yeah. Double cream. Some people have double nah, cream. Nah, I'm doing too You're much. You're a man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let yeah. me get a cheese cake. All right, then. New York, please. Yeah. So Cheesecake. vanilla in that, right? Yeah, all nice. right. Then. Okay. Yeah. Any berries on the side of that? No, no, no berries, just the cake. Mm -hmm. And then one more dessert would be... What, tree of them? Yeah, tree. Yeah. Let me get some mangoes. All right, I then. just want mango. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> so it's nice with the... Okay, the and cake and the... We're also going to give you one more request of anything else you want on this earth. So for example, Ronnie Lee Gardner, he asks to eat the food whilst watching the Lord of the Rings trilogy. So what would yours be? Long it out. I think it would be with a John. Let me just get one. No, what? Never. What? They can get I rose before could. they die. I reckon you could, you know. Let me I just don't get one know, before I go. No, they don't do that though. No, I'm saying, I think, bro, based off this stupid judiciary system, maybe. But I'm saying, let's, let's this, this is my judiciary system. You can do what you want. What yeah, you want? I'd say that. Yeah, what, yeah. Would you want? what would you want? Seriously, go Brazil for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Scout the best talent you can and bring her over for me. <laughs> if I could have one more go before I went, <laughs> wouldn't you? I mean, it's smart. Yeah, <laughs> I'd have I'd have a go. I'd, I'd have a, one more go. Yeah, because think about it. If you've been in death row, you, you're in there years. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's just control, this yeah. the whole time. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, if yeah. I could have one more go, feel the warmth again. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? No, you know what I mean, though, in it. <laughs> you know what I mean, though, in it. Feel the warmth. Feel the warmth. <laughs> Man, I'm putting hands on heaters. Then old in wood. Ain't yeah. The same. Nah. Goalkeeper gloves. Yeah. Nah. Go no. You, that's no, he's a fucking yeah, yeah, he's sicko. Like, and he's grinning as well. Yeah. The man that did it last week. <laughs> Wife was on holiday. No, do you know how mad that yeah, is? Yeah. Putting on a goalie glove. I read that on my blog this morning. You didn't read nothing, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't read nothing. That's his experience. He, he that's a goalkeeper gloves. Try grin um, out. Because he thought you were going to say, yeah, I know about that one. But yeah, um, that was my interact for being so long. Chunks, what would yours be? All right. Barbecue and buffalo wing star. Yeah. You need it. You need that. That's... It, that's same bowl? Couldn't care less, bro. I'm dying. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just get a ranch there near, near it as well somewhere. Thank you very much. Appreciate you, man. We move on. Main course. Gonna get egg fried rice, sweet and sour chicken. Goodness gracious. Yeah, from Good. where? From what? Novikov. That's what I'm gonna say. And then man's gonna get the spring rolls, vegetable. Ooh. Then man's gonna get the shrimp. You know about mm -hmm. that one? Yeah, 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 yeah. Four yeah, mackerel yeah. rolls as well. Don't right, forget yeah. about that All one. Right. And the young, just the steak, medium rare. Uh, and then we're gonna move on to the- Not desserts. medium rare, medium. You eat medium. Is that what I eat? Yeah. Whatever I eat, that one. He knows because he orders it for me. Then we move on. Dessert time. Ooh. Apple crumble. All right then. Raspberry sorbet. Okay. Passion fruit sorbet. Ooh. Custard on him. What, custard on where? On the, the apple sorbet. crumble. No. Oh, okay, no, okay. No, no. Sorbet's on the side. On okay, the edge. Then, that's then, after. Then the raspberry cheesecake. Coolie on it. 
just oh, to right make then. sure that there's coolies on it. And I ain't shouting, but I ain't talking about the Jamaican Indians. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, talking yeah. about coolie. All oh, right. Then we move forward. Mm-hmm. But I need a little drink though. Oh, I didn't, get, I didn't even get a drink. I wouldn't even finish my nah, meals. You're done, you're done. Your throat's dry. Yeah. Your throat's dry. I'm going to have a four litre water just on the side, just to make sure I might even try overdose on the water just so they don't, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And then man will get you a young- You water for what? your last meal? Well, I filtered though. I'm going to have the coldest water. The one that, from here, I'm going to yeah. go to that studio, the one that they used to film the podcast on and get that water for me. Yeah. And then the orange juice- just because, you know what I'm trying to say? I need a There's juice. Smoother origin. pulp. Huh? Smoother. Mixture. Let me get one of each. Wow. One litre of each. Yeah, I like the bit sometimes in an orange juice. Mm. Yeah. If it's I think, well I think after that one, I'll say, cool. I have to say I'm finished now. I need a meal after the dessert. It's called extra mains. And we get Somali rice. Rough. <laughs> Somali rice. So Baris and Hilib. Yeah. Digag chicken. Yeah. yeah. That white sauce and that darkest wedding. Whatever that was. And it needs to be prepped by my sister. Cold. And guess what? In the munch, my sister's attached keys inside the rice. I've got the <gasps> keys. I just enjoyed the munch. Unlock myself. I'm gone. I'm back oh out. Oh my Broken God. Out. Genius. Yeah. I'm back in Somaliland now. Yeah. They can't find me. No extradition. Oh, why did I think like that? So that is the main thing. You get a free munch and then I'm gone. Mm. You got still in the next I'm out, but then how, how did you How did you do with the security that was there? I just opened it. No, but remember he's there. He's there. watch. Stop the time. Everyone did this. Just walk past everyone. So Cameron. everyone's everyone's still like yeah, that, still. and you're just going, hey. and, yeah, I'm just doing this, and then I slap some guy in the face. They push yeah, you. so Remember when the time starts me? again, when he wakes he up, he goes, feels ah, like... you're not thinking, bro. Yeah, yeah. Put yeah, a yeah. key in the munch, open the flipping. I'm out of there. But how did your sister know what what the lock was? Huh? How did? Because she, <laughs> Cause she uh, we used to be friends with the key person in there. Oh, what's the key person's name? Uh, Jeffrey. Who? Not Dharma. No. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's what I said. Yeah, not Dharma. It's a weird but, second name. But actually, I, I, before we move on, I generally think that, yeah, Philly did raise a proper point. Do you think people deserve their last meal? Comment down below. You know, Tom, you uh, Timothy McVeigh, I don't know if that's how you pronounce his name, but his last meal, guess what he requested? Two pints of mint chocolate chip ice cream. That's it. That's sad, that, innit? He didn't know what he was doing. He <sighs> a lot of people don't even agree with this. He must have IBS. I don't agree with the hype around ice cream too much. I, I don't agree with that. I yeah. think ice cream is absolutely incredible, especially a hot summer's day. Get me a mango sorbet, raspberry sorbet, lemon sorbet, passion fruit sorbet. We get it. Sorbet. With all due respect. And guess That's what? I guess cream. I'm eating it with my bae. You get it? Bae, oh. sorbet. Never mind. Oh. We're going to move That's on. That's not ice cream. Just to be Such clear. Such a dad Okay, joke. well, in that case, then give me ice cream, salt and caramel. What? what? About- America's birthday cake. Even a cornetto is good. The unpopular opinion I effing hate the cone I hate it with the little chocolate in the cone I, I, I bite the bottom bit because I'm a greedy bastard then I'm left with this little midsection of cone dash that no. yeah waste of time wafer I'm alright man if wafer needs you to come with chocolate bottom. crazy though yeah <laughs> Fez you got me man no no Fez you got me man you made me say I bite the bottom I meant I bite the bottom bit of the cone of the cornetto <laughs> Yeah, got me. We're going to move on, pussy. Yeah. Um, we're actually going to move on to Start Bench Trade. Uh-huh. I've got some good ones, Philly. Okay. Quickly, I need you to tell me. Start Bench Trade. Alien, Dinosaur, Dragon. Now we're going to do it together like we usually do. Yeah. Alien, Dinosaur, Dragon. So what are you starting in three, two, one, Dragon? Alien. What the mm. hell are you doing with the alien? They've got different technology. Dragon, I'm just jumping on the back of his thing and he's just flying off. Yeah. I'm I'm, I'm, and while you're flying there on the plane holding on for dear life, <laughs> my alien brethren called, I don't know, I don't know what his name is. Yeah, I don't trust them. I mean, Ghana. But, but nah, they don't go Ghana. They, get, they go to different extraterrestrial stuff. So you no, go no, over but, there then. I've got him patterned. Nah, you ain't got him patterned. Nah, I do. In that case, I'm look, not alien look, look. Do you speak alien? Yeah, go on. Speak That's alien. It, look, look. Um, no. I'm still, try- I'm still trying to learn it. Yeah, it's a difficult one. I know to say hello though. Go on. Yeah, that's a good way. That's a good mm. one. Yeah. I actually learned that as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Frukurari. Yeah, why didn't it sound the same as the first time? It does, um, look. Frukurari. Yeah. Nah, frukurari. It's like, it's like Vruku and Rari. Yeah, oh, Vrukurari. Yeah. Frukurari. Yeah, crazy. Yeah. Uh, alien, shout me. Is he talking? Yeah. Are you talking real life? <laughs> an alien, shout me. <laughs> Someone right, so just pull up and say, yo, do you are for? Nah, good for, nah, yeah. good for bit. Please don't, don't say up. alien, no. shout me then. Nah, alien, shout my doggy. <laughs> frukurari. <laughs> yeah. Don't shout me. Yeah, don't shout at me. <laughs> <laughs> so you started aliens, Bench. I started dragging. 
Remember there's dinosaurs, dragons. Yeah, for yeah, yeah. For me, there's dinosaurs, dinosaurs alien. So start bench trade. You're going to be benching in three, two, one, dinosaurs. Dinosaur. So you're dashing dragon. Yeah. I'm dashing Leon. Yeah. I can't be standing. I'm going to be sick of their faces, bro. They look like a mess. No, nah, aliens wow. cold. Next one. I just feel like their technology. Start. I'm basing it off films, by the way. You know what I mean? I, I don't know what's yeah, going on. Yeah, whereas with the, with the dragons and we're the dinosaurs, do you're based it off real life. We're not going to do this next one based off love. We're going to base it off their content. Sharky, Harry Panero, Darkest. Ooh. Start bench trade. Off their content? Yeah. Three, two, one, start, yeah? Yeah, three, two, one, Sharky. Sharky. SDS is not right. Yeah. And not even just that. I feel like his YouTube channel is... Whenever he decides yeah. to upload, yeah, it's, it's better. Good still. And then next up is uh, bench. Uh, three, three, two, two one, one, darkest. darkest. <laughs> no, this is wrong. This is wrong. No, but Harry admits it. He's not consistent yeah, with his YouTube. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. He's been consistent. You know, with... you know what I cry? <laughs> People say Panero on his jacks and YouTube is horror. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what it is? Yeah? I even asked him himself. I said, H, what? Content new ones? Yeah, he goes, yeah, all right. <laughs> he, like, he just prefers to be with the man. Yeah, yeah, you see yeah. H with the man, he's one of the best. Yeah, but yeah. him and his ones... Can't watch it for the life of me, man. <laughs> I try to get through it, I just can't. I but anyway, shout out to Harry, it. man. <laughs> uh, what else? All right, start, Vince trade, Ronaldo, Messi, Neymar. Three, two, one. No, wait, 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 wait. It's easy, bro. Don't do this. It's actually not, you know. It, what, okay, three. Start, start yeah? yeah? Three, two, one, Neymar. Messi. We're going to move on. I'm no, gonna, wait, but no, let me tell no, you why. No, no. Well, like, you don't mean that. See? It doesn't matter. You think Neymar is better than Ronaldo and Messi? No, I don't think- That's why think, I love that he's not on a- I don't, I don't think he's better. What? No, never. What you prefer? But the excitement I get from watching a player, you I love watching Neymar, bro. So you don't get excited about like Messi not, running Not now, you, not now, months? though. Not now, though. Not now. Would you say this excitement? Neymar, no. But you see, when I saw Neymar at Santos, fam, and then during that MSN time, bro, like, don't get me wrong, Messi is a mad baller, but I'm a- like a player that excites me, like Yannick Bellassi, cool. He's not even in that conversation with them, man. Really? But you see, when I watch Yannick he Bellassi, done that like little up. trick to Ericsson. No, I'm just letting you know, I love a player that does mad skills mm. and Neymar delivers that. So you, you, you haven't seen Messi run through 106 man? No, but he's running and just dropping the shoulder. Neymar will do this mad touch with the thing like, oh, you know this stuff. one, you know this one. Yeah. Yeah, you see, he's just breaking the table. Yeah, so I, 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 I definitely hurt my knee and I'm yeah. trying to act like it didn't hurt. Yeah. But you know what I'm talking yeah. about? Like, talking about Neymar's just the mad. Skill skill. That only me and Neymar could remember that video. You're my brother. Yeah, yeah. You've done it yourself yeah, with yeah. Uh, Emil Smith Rowe. Yeah, Thank and Chris you. MD, yeah, yeah. But you get the point I'm trying to make. I really value players that just do the... Exciting stuff. Yeah. Okay, cool. In that case, that's fine. You're not yeah, so I'm not, I'm not based... Never, bro. Messi's the best football player to ever touch planet Earth. But bro. if you're talking about watching Speed a game, you'd rather watch yeah, Neymar. Yeah, I'd rather watch Neymar, bro. Okay, that's fine. I'd rather watch Messi. I'm going to be honest. Fair enough. So then start bench trade. So bench in three, two, one, Ronaldo. Messi. And then... Trade, Ronaldo. That's Ronaldo, yeah? Yeah. Wow, that's insanity. Okay, cool. Next one. No, but, but then if we're talking about Ronaldo. No, too late, too late. Everyone United. knows now. Guys in the comments. Remember when he done Guys in the comments. Philly has now I said that thinking. Neymar is the best. <laughs> then it's... No, don't Dennis say the Ronaldo. best. Don't yeah, do that. Yeah, I'd, Do you clicks, remember clicks, when that... You remember, you remember, I know you remember this clip. You as well, because you watch ball, yeah? Remember when he had the Bouet in a corner and he done a thousand step overs? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and the Bouet just... No, nah, that Ronaldo was crazy. Yeah. That yeah. Bouet was crazy. He gets Pompey. No, that Ronaldo... No, he was different still. All right, next one. Potato, rice, and bread. Ooh. Free. Wait, 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 wait. It's easy, bro. You're doing too much. Our cultures Start, are based yeah. on this. Three, two, two one, one, rice. rice. Our cultures are based on okay, this. Okay, potato and bread. Standard, bro. Three, two, two one, one bread. Yes, yeah, he lost it. He lost it. You don't like sandwiches. I love sandwiches. I don't. Yeah, that's why you said it's it. It's cold. With these. It's cold. I want a hot meal, thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't want cheese. Lettuce and a tomato I in my like sandwich. No, no, so what do you have disgusting. in yours then? Me. Tuna. Tuna. Boring. Yeah. Potato. Yeah. What? Roast potatoes with a roast dinner. Uh, You've uh, lost your I, mind. As a Somali man, I have roast the dinners. Give, give a shit Jack about potatoes. potato. Yeah. What? Cheese and beans. But why, this is why cheese and beans? You could have absolutely I don't like anything. I don't, like, jack jack chili. I don't like it. Tuna and a roast potato. What's, what's, what's wrong potato? with bread? What's wrong with bread? Bread? Yeah. I don't know. It's just me dog. So that means that you can't have burgers? Fuck. What you forgot? This pussy, you forgot that stuff. See? Now you're thinking. Bruschetta. When you like a little bruschetta, right? No, but I'd rather a little steak and a mashed potato or a chips. Car, cool man. Don't eat your chips, man. Eat oh, a cool. burger. That's on gonna save me calories, yes. Thank you. Yeah, very but much. then you're still gonna get more calories and bread. No, nope, chips is the worst. Fried and oil and nah. 
No. You, you enjoy yourself, man. You got heart problems, man. Do you not like bread? I or do you, like bread, right. but we start bench trade, innit? So someone's got to go. But you also say you don't like pizza. So I feel like baked things are kind of not a thing. For he doesn't like pizza. He hates it. Horrible. But is there like a logic behind that? Yeah, he just says it. No, do you know why I'm backwards though? Because I like burrata. And what's burrata? Cheese and bread. Yeah. With tomatoes. But yeah, so literally bread. the same thing. And then last but not least, this is on a girl, right? Hair, nails, and skin. Ooh. Three. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Think about it. Come on, bro. Oh, wow. Hair, Come on, bro. Skin. Three, two, one, skin. skin. And then second. the second is hair and nails. Yeah. Three, two, one, hair. hair. And then so that's my guy though. Last one at least. He loses it a little bit. Yeah. Three, two, one, nails. So you're saying that you don't mind if a girl had this, your toes? Yeah, I don't suck toes. So your girl is just walking on those trotters and they're blessed with it. All right, can you stop posting on your <laughs> Snapchat as well? Stop trying to use my toes for views. I don't like that you do that. <laughs> When you're low you on think views, I didn't you see do it. The, you think I Whenever didn't, I'm low on views, you, 100 replies to that. You think I didn't see it the other day? Sorry, man. Why don't you reply to me? You don't really and do you know what's even me? worse? It was Chip. Chip what? He screenshotted it. Yeah. And he goes, nah, blood. Yeah. Chunks is out in you. I yeah. It, I said, oh, I had to, man. I guess me views, bro. Does that actually? Yeah, it does me well. Toes are shit, innit? Yeah, your toes are horrific. I need a, I need a, I need a, um, a foot surgeon, man. <laughs> Okay, that, and Philly, just, let me just ask you this. This is an Oxford and Cambridge entry question. I just want to ask you a couple of these quickly. What are you reading at the moment? <laughs> uh, currently reading... Uh, um, yeah, trying to think of a title. Good one, man. Rich Dad, Poor Dad. Oh, that's that one that, that guy, that businessman was watching, right? Yeah. Rich Dad, uh, currently definitely not reading. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, guys, I'll be honest. Um, one I don't read, I don't read. Philly, we don't really read. Uh, uh, we're, yeah. we're doofuses. We watch. Yeah, we, we like to watch and listen to documentaries. And, well, I do. Mm. I, I love listening to documentaries. And I like animal docs. Yeah, that's 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 someone that's just got no IQ. You know what I mean? He's one of animal dogs, not enough. <laughs> do you listen to audio books? No. Do you listen to an audio? I book? do. I do a couple of times. Yeah. yeah. No. I'm taking the piss, but I, I don't like, like like reading. I can't like. I can't hold my. I can't hold my um. I'm not attention for too long. I think TikTok has absolutely killed attention span. So for now, like even when I watch videos, I have to times it by 1.5. You're joking. I'm a mess, brother. It's bad now, man. How do you do that? Uh, you just oh. hold on to the video. It says playback speed. Click 1.5. Cool. Yeah, because you know when a man's waffling for four minutes, like I have to just make it quick, please. I do that for football I got, reviews. I got to watch another one. You do that for what? Football reviews. Yeah. A lot of people talking about football matches. I can keep up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't be asked for that, man. That's sad though. Do you, do you, do you not want to lower your kind of rate of what you want to watch stuff so that you can become a bit more relaxed? You are To be fair, relaxed. me being relaxed is me in bed watching TikToks. 1.5 speed. I love it, man. Wow. It's just my thing, I'll be honest. Is it? Yeah. I'm not using in, in like too much of mental capacity. I'm just literally enjoying myself watching a video and mindlessly. You're not going to ask me why I did that. Are you the same? I was going to say. No, no, it's all good, bro. Bro, go on, man. <laughs> nah, that's cool, bro. I, I just... I can no, come on, you're, you're you know, very pretty. Nah, that's cool, man. All right. All right. Do you know what it is? We're going we're gonna to touch on this quickly, but we're going to talk about it more in another podcast because I really like this. If you were to create a new part of London, what would it be called? Bundeville. Bundeville? Yeah. And who would live there? Bundes. Only girl? Yeah. Yeah. And me, and I only select the males that live there. Yeah, who'd you select? You. No, I won't select chunks. <laughs> yeah, don't put me there. There's different calibers of bundas there. Yeah, Would yeah. you live in this part of town? Would you be the mayor of I've, No, no, no. I've invented it. Right. I run no, it. No, Everyone I'm not aware of the concept. Yeah. I care Everyone knows it, me. Would you... <laughs> Would you be the mayor of Bundeville? I don't care what I am, but everyone <laughs> right. will know yeah. that I am the reason we all live good. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't care what role I've got. Oh, like, the I walk down the street and I go, oh, yeah. Like That's they're really, in awe of me. Yeah, yeah, they can't believe Bundeville. it. Bundeville, everyone's just got mad buns. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, That's very clear. My woods are 24 <laughs> 7. You know what I mean? Is that okay in Bundeville? Is that all right? If yeah. you're just walking around with a raging boner, is that all right? No, 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 no. I'm not saying it's all the time raging. Oh. But if I want to dish him, mm -hmm. there's not an issue there. Yeah. Wherever you 24s are. 24s is just a riser. Right. That's me. Bundeville. You're in the cafe, see someone you like. Oi, this, this is Bundeville. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Charlene, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she just loves you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Instant. You just can't believe Instant. it. You, you, you Bring the coffee. That. Instant. Yeah. yeah. I reckon I'll get sick of it after two months. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Bundeville. So, now, I call it Bundeville, just have a bunch of Johns there. It's yeah, quite, so, quite different to other London names, I'd say. Yeah, to, no, very different. Yeah. 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 You've got Piccadilly Circus. Bakerloo Line. <laughs> <laughs> Calling at Bundeville. <laughs> Calling at 
Bundyville, but you can only get off if you've got a bunda Man yeah. back. and a filly hey. likes you. Yeah. Yeah. And they scan it. As you walk in, someone just goes. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> Not enough. <laughs> didn't really shake because I just give up on my goat. I didn't know it could jiggle like that. Right. Yeah. She can, yeah, yeah, she can live pass. <laughs> and then, and No, how this shit comes to my head is, uh, is you're fucking, a fucking ridiculous. Sicko. It's how ridiculous. You as, as I walk around, is it like, you know, you're the mayor and you're in all the signs, like giving a thumbs up. Yeah, and yeah, 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 and yeah. Like, yeah. No, that's like, um, suit, that's got... like Dubai. There's this guy everywhere in Dubai. Yeah. What, what is he to Dubai? I couldn't tell you, bro. The Emir. Same family. with Qatar though. Yeah. They, when they we went Qatar. Like, they got the Emirs, the, the head of the royal family. Oh, that's yeah, what it is then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But yeah, when you go to Arab countries, like it's, they're absolutely everywhere, bro. Yeah, yeah. Every building, every billboard, it'll yeah. be the same guy's face everywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be me. Yeah. yeah. Mm. It's grinning. Yeah. Hold Just it like that. We're back here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Welcome. But <laughs> <laughs> well, well, how many men are allowed there though? Maximum five and I pick them. <laughs> <laughs> And how much And they've got to let me know what they're doing that day. Yeah, do, how, do, how many girls are there in the bill? Four or six. Four or six girls? Yeah, yeah that, he's enjoying it forever. Do all the roads lead to your place? So it's very yeah. easy oh, to find. Oh, okay, now this is getting sick now. It, a joke got taken too far. Um, you called it Bundaville. Yeah, it was a joke. It was meant to be a lot. A lot. La, 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 I, I can't I even speak. You're shaped in a bunda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's right. a part of London, which is Bundaville big, but... won't exist now. <laughs> it's turning sick. Right, listen, last night in the comments, if you would like to be living in Bundaville with Philly, yeah, uh, yeah, he would love to see you guys what, there. Uh, what kind of? What, what, what are you going for? Me, I'm yeah. gonna tell you what the suggestions are. What for the names? For the names. These, uh, yeah, sorry. The about number this. one place that that has been voted by everybody is Pinpon Avenue. <laughs> Little dog park and stuff. <laughs> hey, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. appreciate you watching this app. No, please, please. There's another good name. A couple more, man. Got Chunk Circus, Panero Palace, Darkest Road, South Sharkington, Felipe Court Road. That's good. Fillage, Fort Milliton. It's Chunks Fillage. Park. Huh? Fillage. Fillage. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Chunks Park, Beta Junction, instead of Croydon, Fullerton. Felipe Cross. I like that one. Felipe Cross is a good place. Poor dog though, man. Huh? Still think about that. Not well. He's a funny name. He's not well. No, he's actually not. He hasn't improved since the last time we spoke. No. Is it? Anything I can do? No. No. Is that the dog? It's the email. Oh, cool. Uh, someone's called a Philly. Maybe start a little fund or something for the dog. Yeah, should you start a little GoFundMe for, for Pimpon? No, life is life, innit? Yeah. He'll go soon. He's not well. He'll go soon. It's fun. <laughs> no, don't make it funny Come on, again. man. He'll go soon. Don't, don't be careful. With but he ladies. will. No, God forbid. It's just touch. life. Yeah. You'll go one day. I'll go one day. Yeah. It's just life, bro. Everyone will go one day. Very soon. Yeah, but you can't say that, though. What? I, I'm, it's my dog. Okay, cool. You can't sit there and say my dog's going soon. All right, then. I'll don't wish it. that on my dog. I'll never wish anything upon your dog. I can wish stuff on my dog. <laughs> How could you... It's my dog though, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, what you should do is wish for him to get better. He won't. Mm. Well, God could do anything. I know he can. Yeah. But you also God can made... make him free as old again. Yeah, but you also made life life. Accept it, man. Can we end this? A bit emotional about my dog. Yeah, all right, just... guys, please yeah. make sure you um Philly Road Terminal 123 was a pretty funny name. But yeah. What was it? What was the uh, name? <laughs> so we got, we're gonna go Beta Forest, Squadington. Uh, Beta Forest is cold. Philsham. Yeah. You got, Phil Sherm, like Lucia. Yeah, you got uh, Philly Road Terminal 1, 2, and 3. You know, Heathrow. <laughs> Cold. Chunks Law and Chunks Oak. Guys. Chunks Oak, like Seven Oak. Yeah. Or like Bat Oak. Or Royal Oak. Enough. Yep, there you go. Royal Oak as well. Let Sorry, us I'm know. just a South Let guy. us know. Let us know. Let us know. If you could name a place in London, what it would be called and why it would be called that. Also, we are really trying to hit that 1 million subscribers one day. Yeah, man. And if you subscribe, that will get us closer. Another very important thing before we end off here is Grey Philly um, is in the link in the description. It's make sure you buy it if you can. Make sure you watch stream the music it as much video, as you want. Do whatever you watch the music do. video. And Philly will be on a stage near you soon. And best believe, best believe, I will be there. That would be my amazing. Um, with that being said, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And I've been Chugs. I've been Philly. God bless you all. Bye. Please um, make sure you're safe. Take care. Bye. Enjoy your day. Eat good food. And don't be a fool. And if you want to apply for Bundaville, shout Philly in the DMs. Yes. Um, and that is at Young Philly. At Young Philly. Yep.
Take care, take care. Don't stare, beware. In the fuck. And if you want to beware, then don't be afraid. Because when you're afraid, you lead away. <laughs> what the fuck am I saying? That's, that's, what, that's what people are bullying us. <laughs> what the fuck? Turn it off. Yeah, turn it off. Turn it off. It still says record. Okay, turn it off now.